What's up guys? Um, so I had another dream. This one was last Saturday, um, September the 2nd of 2017. It started out, we were, I was at a lake house with, you know, family and friends, um, I guess on a little vacation. It was daytime out, but it started to rain. Um, this rain happened without clouds. Um, Outside, it slowly started to get dark, but it wasn't because of clouds. This was a, a solar eclipse. Um, this one was a very, very unexpected solar eclipse. Uh, nobody had any idea this was happening. Um, the rain could still continued to pour. Um, as the solar eclipse went through, you know, wherever it was going, um, as it would so start to get dark wherever it was going, the power would go out. So as soon as it started to get, to get dark in this lake house, all the power shut out. And I ran to, to the front door, but as I was going to go and open the door to look outside, I knew, I stopped and I knew that I shouldn't do this. There would be consequences to opening this door. Um, so I, I look out the window, and I see, you know, we're at a lake house again, so here's the water here. And I see boats just going straight up onto this land and going as fast as they possibly can. Um, you know, husband and wife, you know, taking their children, trying to take cover, um, in the woods, um, to avoid this rain. Um, this rain was hurting them for some reason. Um, I kind of got like an acidy feel and, um, I'll touch again on that after I explain the dream. So this rain was coming, rain was coming down and it was hurting them. Um, as it got to the totality, I guess, of the eclipse, I heard someone outside yell that the moon is dripping in blood. I got a quick little flash or quick picture of what it what the moon was doing or looked like. And if you just Google like a blood moon, this was not what I seen. I seen the blood just cover the moon. It was literally the moon was caked in blood, and it was just dripping off of the moon. You could see the drops just drip, drip drip off of the moon. This was a true blood moon. Um, it started to get light back outside again. Um, I believe the power did stay off. Um, there was screams coming out from outside of the house. Here and there from it, I guess from those affected by the rain. Um, after the sun came out, I woke up. So just doing a quick little Google search on acid rain, it took me to Job chapter 18 verse 15 through 21 and it only it brought up the MSG version uh, why I don't know but I'm gonna read it to you starting in again Job 18 verse 15 through 21 their lives go up in smoke acid rain soaks their ruins their roots rot and their branches wither they'll ne they sorry They'll never again be remembered, nameless and unmarked graves. They are plunged from light into darkness, banished from the world, and they leave empty-handed, not one single child, nothing to show for their life on this earth. Westerners are aghast at their fate. Easterners are horrified. Oh no, so this is what happens to preserve people? This is how the God ignorant will end up. Um, I encourage you to look over this for yourself, um, to do a little bit of your own research, but um, this scripture alone kind of, I guess, confirms my, uh, my prayer for a confirmation of the dream. Um, it's, it's pretty spot on. I... I feel like even reading the before and after of 15, you know, going through and looking at the whole chapter, it's, it's, it's very similar to what I seen. Um, it was, people were running and it, they were very, very fearful and this rain was not, not fun. It looked like, um, that's all for this one. Um, God bless you all. Thank you for watching. If you guys have anything to add to this, please. You know, put it in the comments. Um, be sure to look at the description if I add anything later. Uh, 
I believe I always do usually add at least one thing later on. Uh, again, thank you all. Uh, may God bless you all.